talking about the rain. We're getting ready to have a, a storm five alert go into effect this morning and you are seeing <laughs> major problems on the roads already. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Those wet roads are, are definitely affecting people. Lots of crashes, especially yeah. on I-24. All right, some yeah. some issues there. Yeah, Yeah. so we'll continue to watch mm -hmm. that right now. The storm five alert will go into effect at eight o'clock this morning. That's when the threat begins to pick up for some stronger storms, although we put it in early at eight o'clock because of some flash flooding and then late this morning into the afternoon is when the severe weather threat picks up. Let's show you what is happening right now for today. Area rain and thunderstorms across the mid south Florida south there. Southern counties in the 60s today, northern counties in the 50s, and you can see that temp spread with our exclusive Skynet cameras there. Hopkinsville 39. This is real time information right now. 39 uh, in Hopkinsville, Clarksville 41, Lawrenceburg 62, but right at 50 out of Gallatin and Dixon. So with this setup for us today, we run the risk of a couple of stronger thunderstorms with damaging wind gusts. Winds may be up to about 60 miles per hour. Some localized flooding out there. We had a flash flood warning earlier over in the central part part of Sumner County. Not really worried about a tornado threat, but you cannot totally rule out a stray or an isolated tornado for today. Similar with hail, the hail threat is low, but uh, a couple of spots could see it for today. Here is a look at what's happening right now on radar. Rain here winter weather as you head back over to the show me state for us right now and some of the rain here in Nashville. If you see the dots, that's some of the lightning that is showing up on our lightning detection network for us. Now we see some of that around Pickett County and Clay County. This is all pushing north northeast here in Nashville. There's the rain as it continues to come down, but you'll note red and yellow and orange from time to time and that's that rain coming down at a heavier clip right now. It's heavier around Ashland City and down toward Pleasant View and then as you ride along I 40 there is the rain. It's along a stationary front and the setup of that front as it kind of moves just a little bit has Nashville floating between 60 degrees several hours ago to 54 for us at this current time. Later today the whole system pulls through bringing the severe weather threat, the threat greater south of us, but we'll watch along I-40 and especially late this morning into the afternoon when we could see some strong wind gust, damaging wind gust out there later today. But here's exact track bringing areas of rain over the mid south and along the front itself. Here comes the cold front. See that line right there? That's the cold front coming in the afternoon hours. That's when that threat for a few stronger storms will pick up into the eastern counties. That pulls out of here, but by tomorrow morning, there may be even a couple of passing snowflakes in parts of the mid state area. Your seven day forecast temps in the 60s today, northern counties in the 40s for tomorrow. We're all in the upper 30s and low 40s, and then temperatures try to recover to near 50 as we head toward the end of the week and the weekend. Right now, the time is just about 650. Let's check in with Blake. 